Hi, this is my open letter to future social web for social change students. This summer 2012 was an experiment to see how a condensed version of the class could work and we found out that five weeks was not nearly enough. Hey, what did I learn in this class? What did I learn in this class? That there is so much more to learn. I think that people who were somewhat familiar with the equipment and the social media venues might have had uh, an opportunity to get some really deep experience and learnings out of this class and then for the rest of us who may not have had some of that familiarity it was a fairly steep learning curve and our, I know I am still continuing to learn but now I've branched into Twitter and Tumblr I have honed in on uh, more of my personal branding and I have learned tools to be able to continue to do so throughout my life and career. These are invaluable processes that I never would have had had I not taken social web for social change. I learned about setting up a successful Facebook page and promoting it and looking at behaviors that have already started and encouraging them to keep going. It's a big world out there. How are you going to affect your change? What are you passionate about and what kind of change do you want to make in this world? Maybe you're passionate about bikes. Or water. Or gardens. Or mindfulness. Are you lurking or are you actually participating in the conversation? The more you practice, the more mindful and purposeful you will become. You get out of it what you put into it. This is your sandbox or toolkit as it were to take with you for the rest of your life. How will you use it? The technology of today is already different from 10 years ago. How will you shape the next 10 or 50? Who are you trying to reach and why? Are you being mindful with your process? Social change doesn't just affect others. You change in the process too. Oh, 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 oh. Have fun with it. If you're not having fun, other people may not be attracted to your message. You can do so much on your own and teamwork will add up to much more than the sum of your parts. Know and love your Cialdini tactics of persuasion. The way you approach your message can make a difference whether you're a big bull or a slow turtle. That's not a bull. Consider your argument from a different perspective to see if you might have a more effective means of looking at the situation. Ship early, ship often, fail quickly, to succeed quickly. Babies and cute animals will capture people's attention every time, even if it's a lolcat. cat. Numbers are not the end-all means for measurement. Did I mention shipping early and often and failing quickly to succeed quickly? The sky is the limit.